Jam it on the J-O-B. Today's R&B and Old School. 103.1 KISS FM. I am not understanding Janet Jackson and her reasoning for getting a divorce from this man that loves her. Well, I got 500 million reasons why she wants to walk away from this, this marriage. And Janet need her behind beat for this. <laughs> because the man loved her. Because this is the story. Now, they got... Well, she got cold feet the first time they were supposed to get married. He tore up that prenup and came up with this prenup that gives her... Five hundred million dollars in the event that they divorce, but she has to be married to him for five years. Well, January made five years. This heifer done had a baby, and now she hollering about divorce because he won't get involved in that Jackson family mess. I'll, I don't blame. I'll blame, I'll blame him for that me. either. But uh, that yeah, that's that's why she's getting up out of this marriage. Five hundred million dollars, and she only had to make it to five years. Well, it's two months past that five year mark, and she didn't have the baby, so that means more money for Janet. So yes, the scam has been on since day one. She shouldn't get. Nah, she, she shouldn't get no damn child support. You got half a billion dollars. <laughs> and you messing it up for women like me that's trying to get a man and be in a real relationship. Now, you done scared half of them because they think we're going to pull some foolishness like that. Shannon, if in hell, okay, well, at least she had the baby. We know she had the baby, but she's probably going to get the damn baby away, too. All right. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's move cold. on. Let's go. And, man, she... Hiding them other kids, got that man on TV on cocaine and all that jittering and shaking up in the rehab. Could you stay married to someone knowing that at a certain amount or at, at the end of a certain period of time you'll get a fat check? I don't think so. I mean, I, I would, if I was gonna get a half a billion dollars, I'm gonna be honest. I'm going to give it my all. <laughs> but <laughs> if, if you getting on my nerves, I can't say that I can stay with you for five years or two months because about a year and a half into it, I'll be like, you know what? Forget you and that money and everything else to come along with this. I just have to go back to being a broke chick. Because that takes discipline, if you ask me. That is that is that takes a lot of discipline. And also, shout out to uh, to, to our number one number one fan of Divorce right now, and that's Kendu Isaac. Hashtag, we Man, support you, Kendu. We else? support you, Kendu. What else? Whatever. And unfortunately, no, I don't have that kind of discipline. <laughs> <laughs> Catch Jamming on the Job weekdays from 9 a.m. until 3 p.m. on today's R&B Old School, 103.1 KISS FM.